Hi guys, my name is Adina and you are watching the Spanish Guitar Hub and today we are going to learn some percussion or drumming techniques on the guitar. And after this lesson you can learn something like this. I just want to say that I have a course which has very similar lessons to this one. It is called Spanish Guitar Strumming Techniques and it has 19 different lessons and over 150 exercises. Sign up for my course on the link under this video. Before we start the drumming techniques on the wood, we need to learn how to do the same thing while we are strumming. So the hand is in an open fist position. So it means that you have like a little hole and then you go down with all the fingers when you are using the fingernails and you use the fingernail on the thumb when you go up. Now also everything needs to come from the wrist because if you use your arm it will be too many movements and you cannot go so fast. So it's all from the wrist. It is like kind of little movements from the wrist and then you turn down and you turn up. So. Let's do this faster. Now let's start to have accents. Accent mean that you will add like a louder movement. So this will be one loud movement and after everything will be quieter. Now let's do this with one loud movement and one down up, down up. So it will be actually in 3-4 because it will be 1-2-3-1-2-3-1-2-3-1-2-3-1-2-3-1-2-3-1-2-3-1-2-3-1-2-3-1-2-3-1-2-3-1-2-3-1-2-3-1-2-3-1-2-3-1-2-3-1-2-
I'm going to do the other rhythm that we just did, which will be down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up. Now, also, you can move this around on the guitar because everything sounds a little bit uh, different. So this is a little bit higher and this is lower. So the same thing you can do in different positions on the guitar and it will sound different. So like this. Let's start to add some hits with the hand as well. This will make it sound really, really nice. And this will sound something like this. Before we start to do this, we need to learn this on the guitar too, uh, before we add it onto the wood as a strumming technique. Because as a strumming technique, it will be like this. Even with the chord, you can hear it. Down, down, up, hit. Down, up, down, up, down, up, hit. Down, down, up, hit. Down, up, down, up, down, up, hit. Actually, I add uh, like a connection as well. So it will be down, down, up, hit, down, up, down, up, down, up, hit, down, up, down, down, up, hit, down, up, down, up, down, up, hit. So that's how you connect two of them and it sounds a little bit more smooth. So down, down, up, hit, down, up, down, up, down, up, hit, down, up, down, down, up, hit, down, up, down, up, down, up, hit, down, up. The challenge will be that whenever we add the down, up, down, up, or down, uh, we will do this on the wood here. And when we start to add the hits, we will do it here. Down, down, up, hit, down, up, down, up, down, up, hit, down, up, down, down, up, hit, down, up, down, up, down, up, hit, down, up. This is quite a nice way to incorporate the drumming on the guitar. Uh, now let's move the hit to a different point. We can do it here so it will be more deep and more powerful. Let's have a look at another technique that you can use for drumming. Again, you need to learn the technique at first on the guitar, and this will be the flamenco triplet. When you use the flamenco triplet on the wood, it sounds like this. This is actually quite nice to incorporate in the rhythm as well, because the rhythm is going to change to triplets when you do this with the down up, down up. Um, so the technique will be, at first you need to learn it on the guitar, that you use these two fingers, so the middle and ring, to go down while you are not moving the hand, and then you turn your wrist with the thumb, and the thumb needs to arrive turned out and under the strings because it needs to come back. So it will be down, turn, turn, down, turn, turn. As you can see, it is coming from the wrist as well. It is only not coming from the wrist in the first movement. After it is turn, turn. So down, turn, turn, down, turn, turn. Down, turn, turn. You can see my hand is not moving, my wrist is moving. Now, 
Now, this can take a lot of practice and a lot of weeks or months, and you need to do it in the right way, otherwise you are not going to get the right sound. I have actually other videos or other lessons in my course about this one. Just look for Flamenco Triplet on my YouTube channel or go to the Flamenco Triplet lesson on my course. <clears throat> now, let's move this to the wood. Let's uh, mix this technique with the other techniques that we learned. We can start with the flamenco triplet and then we can move to the down-up, down-up movement. So let's start practicing it, how you can change between the two. So you go with triplet, down-up, down-up. I think you can even hear the difference between these two because the sound is a little bit different with the triplet. Let's uh, do some improvisation with all of the techniques that we learned today. There was only one more thing that I added in the end, actually, and this was the rumba technique. Rumba technique, it is when you add the hit and you go up with the index finger, you go a turn with the index finger down and you turn back with the thumb. So again, this is coming from the wrist, hit, up, turn, turn, hit, up, turn, turn. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, hit the like button or subscribe for more videos like this because I'm uploading new guitar videos every Sunday. So see you guys next Sunday with another guitar video.